All right, what is going on guys? Today we are watching episode two of the Millionaire Detective Balance Unlimited. I have started on episode two on the channel. Obviously I've watched episode one because I wanted to see how episode one turned out before I started uploading it to the channel. And I was very interested in the story and the characters. So I've decided to go on to episode two, starting now on the channel. Um, I'm looking forward to see how the series pans out because it seems to have a lot of, uh, what's the word? I don't know. I I have hope that the series will be pretty interesting. Like just going off of what we've seen so far, uh, it seems to be pretty pretty well received to by the the community, um, sp specifically for a few reasons mainly. But if you haven't watched this already, it's basically like, in my opinion, um, Bruce Wayne uh, becoming a cop, except he's much richer than Bruce Wayne, and he's a little bit more of a dick, but it makes him cool <laughs> so yeah uh anyway without further ado let's get right into the series right now I dialed up. <laughs> what is this peasant food? Oh no. Yeah, <laughs> does he like it? <laughs> He's <laughs> following him, isn't he? <laughs> Why is this guy in like this lower rank? Police division. He seems very competent for a cop. I wonder what he did. I thought black haired dude would be taller. Is grey haired dude taller? Interesting. This intro is such a bot, by the way. It's so unique. Actually, such a bot. It's like, as I said, it's like such a unique intro for anime, but it's like. It's very like James Bondy, obviously, but it's an actual bot. The last episode where, you know, he was like busting through the street in his in his like tank of an armored car. Speaking to his uh, butler through his glasses thing. Like Jarvis. It was fucking it was so cool. <laughs> I looked at he bought like the um, the prince's car for like a billion yen, which is like seven million pounds or something. That is crazy. Yeah, the grey dude, grey dude is taller. The black haired dude gives off a very tall, dark vibe. Interesting. Yeah, stuff like that. It's just so James Bondy, isn't it? That little rewind bit gives me JoJo vibes. It's funny. Huh? 
Hej. Are they drug users? Is he allowed to know that? This is clearly his like hacking interrog inter interrogation stuff, but like this is much further past police level, knowing being allowed to knowing of stuff. <laughs> He's just gonna buy it. I, you'd be surprised how much money this guy has. <laughs> That's one way to do it. Hmm. I would explain why another model died of a drug overdose, right? <laughs> so the other dude got like made to feel bad. And then they still got money <laughs> for the same answer. That's funny. <laughs> I like that how he doesn't like he's not the type to just like Bleh, you know cheap food Jeez. The scales from the uh, the opening, right? That's awesome. Love does much. Money does everything. It's true. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh. 
Oh boy. Yeah, that's way more worth getting it. To find the supplier is a way more bigger boss than just beating him. Mmm, tasty. Oh, is this like a personal, like, rich ass RV thing? Or is this a. Was that like a restaurant? Why would they do peel back in restaurant? What the heck? Oh boy. He so, he so wants to br just bring him down now, but he just can't do it yet. I love the art style in this anime. The characters are really interesting. Like, to look at and whatnot. Hmm. You stink. <laughs> oh. Oh, boy. <laughs> Is that her? Oh god. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Drives like a mad one. What the hell? She lost him. He, well, both, I suppose. He lost her. She lost him. Is it this dude? What's up? Does he stink? Is this his home? It's his home, isn't it? This is his house, isn't it? He stinks. He proper stinks. <laughs> Oh, he's actually Bruce Wayne. Holy crap. <laughs> She's like on the cover, isn't she? <laughs> Damn. I wonder what this the rich guy's alter. Um, reasoning for being a cop is is he going after someone specifically is he just doing it for society what is he doing yeah he proper stinks don't he <laughs>
But it, it, like, if he's if he wants to, and he's getting rid of crime groups, why not? So is she like what? Sister? Wife? What is it? Got to be a wife, right? What is it? Hang on a minute. I've seen that costume before. <laughs> hmm. Smooth. Oh. <laughs> oh boy. Patrocon. <laughs> Gotta be a helicopter or something. I know. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> nah, this guy's too rich. <laughs> What? <laughs> Is he blowing it up? Oh, it's gas.
This guy's too rich. <laughs> How do you even have the authority to fly a military helicopter in the middle of sea? <laughs> Wow. Why did you join the police? <laughs> What's the problem? <laughs> Aww. I see. Hong Kong. Uh, 83 mi million? 83 billion, probably. Jesus. God damn. Well, that was a cool last episode. Let's see what's way in the uh, end in regards to a preview, shall we? So, that was the Millionaire Detective Balance Unlimited Episode 2. Pretty cool episode. His, I don't know, his regard to money is nice. No, not really nice, but you know what I mean? Like, he's not full of himself. He's just using money for r the right reasons. He's a pretty over-the-top, like, with the, the whole military helicopter and buying the actual tower and stuff. But if it works, it works. His balance is still unlimited, so it's pretty cool. Um, I really want to know who he is, how he came about his money and stuff like that, and what his reason for being a cop is. So hopefully we find that out at some point. I'm sure we will. It's obviously it's a main factor in the story, this guy. So, yeah. Um, other than that, not really much to say. A really great episode. And I can't wait to continue the series. And, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your week. And peace out.